On behalf of the Atlanta chapter of Data Yoga Center USA, it is my pleasure to welcome you to a program of meditation and healing music by Dr. Sri Ganapati Sachidananda Swamiji and his celestial messengers from Mysore, India. Before Sri Swamiji comes to the stage, I wanted to invite Yogini Kalaji to come to the podium and introduce Sri Swamiji's music to the audience and then to introduce Sri Swamiji himself and the musicians. Kalaji. Good evening. After silence, that which comes nearest to expressing the inexpressible is music. A quote by Aldous Huxley. To experience the supreme silence where all desire cease bestows the universal feeling of oneness the non-duality that is expressed through scripture and transcendental philosophy. Music emerges from silence. Music returns us to silence. Tukosti expressed it well. A painter paints pictures on canvas, but musicians paint their pictures on silence. Music began on earth before the human species entered with the sounds of ocean waves, leaves blown by the wind, birds singing their songs, and animals with their diverse languages. Throughout humankind, the orchestra of nature draws people to relax, rejuvenate, renew, to heal as the mind calms, to touch the sounds. This is the essence of Nada Yoga, the yoga of sound, also known as Nada Chikitsa, sound healing. Indian music has its roots in spirituality, dating back to approximately 1500 to 1000 BCE in the Rig Veda, a collection of hymns that were initially sung in monotone and later developed into three tones. In the Salma Veda, additional notes were added to make the first seven note scale or raga. Between the 14th and 16th centuries, Indian classical music began to emerge. Yogis and saints often use myth, the wonderful music, the nadam, as their vehicle. As the great composer Beethoven said, Music is a higher revelation than all wisdom and philosophy. It is commonly said that when words fail, music continues. Today, music therapy is becoming more accepted as a healing modality due to the extensive research being done, which proves the positive effects of sound on the body, mind, not only during the music session, but even after the music has ended. Scientific research has observed that when the Indian classical music stimuli were removed, significant alpha brain rhythms continued. With the advancement 
and music therapy, two categories have been developed. Medical music therapy. That's music with a trained music therapist. And music medicine. Music with a patient. Tonight, we will experience both. As this renowned composer is a prolific artist with full capacity for music expression. Has done extensive research in the field of therapeutic music for the past 30 years and has released over 200 music CDs and videos. In this way, we have the complete music therapy experience, a master music therapist with a garden of music medicine. Presently, on his 156th world tour to bring forth music for meditation and healing. He has performed in the most prestigious concert halls, Lincoln Center, Kennedy Center, Royal Albert Hall, Sydney Opera House, and Haoyang China International Conference Center, and many more. He holds two doctorate degrees in music and literature, and nine Guinness World Records for music and service to humanity, and is a multi-instrumentalist, a lyricist in several languages, a singer par excellence, and a composer of thousands of compositions. In India, I have attended music for meditation and healing concerts with over 100,000 people in attendance. We are very fortunate to be in this hall, which provides us with such an intimate musical experience with this mystical yogi legend. We simply need to relax, let the breath flow, and concentrate on the sound therapy. Now, everyone, please warmly welcome Dr. Sri Ganapati Sachidananda Swamiji to the stage. Accompaniment is by the Celestial Message Troupe. These scholarly musicians are from Abhiduta Datta Pitam, Mysuru, India. The melody side on violin, Vidvan Jaitra Varanasi. <laughs> on keyboard, Vidvan Narasimha Mani. <laughs> the rhythm side on Mridangam, Vidvan Shankar Ramesh. <laughs> on Tabla, Vidvan Mahesh Bhatt. On drum pad, Vidvan J. Datta. Mm -hmm. J. Guru Datta. Kalaji. Next, I request Chaitna and Himanshu Joshi to offer a garland to Sri Swamiji.
Next, I request Ms. Renee Unterman, a state senator for Georgia representing District 45, to please offer a garland to Sri Swamiji. Senator Unterman is a former mayor of the city of Loganville and a former Gwinnett County Commissioner. She has written many laws to support children who have been trafficked, including a constitutional amendment called Safe Harbor. Next, I invite Ms. Shirley Wynn to offer a garland to Sri Swamiji. Next, I'd like to invite Pinky and Sunit Shah to offer a Vostrum to Sri Swamiji. Sri Swamiji, if everything is all okay, I would like to reverentially invite you to shower us with your beautiful nodded this evening.
today's star is jester very uh, unique star some people doesn't know about what it is music some people already knows and their good experience with this music there are so many different music in this world but in this particular music is ancient music raga ragini vidya is a very ancient in kurta yuga treta dwapara yuga also there now we are using for this kali yuga and my childhood and my mother gave us this knowledge and her poor father also there using for this kind of music and she is using for only cultivation and some trees some flowers and some cows they gives good milk and they using for some different kind of a flowers this music that is actually the music only for so good crops they gives for good crops and then my childhood is only 4 and a half year 5 years uh, i think and i am thinking why not you will use for this human being There are so many people is suffering so many different kind of diseases and also this music is very near to yoga and muladhara to sahasrara and chakras all chakras and also this music very near to crystal and this music is very near to astrology astrology and mani shastra and very near to herbal indian medicine we calculated after that so many years maybe 18 20 years i am researching to the beginning in only singing then later on gives to different sounds maybe one is like a veena like a sitar indian instruments and chlorinate is so different different according to same different instruments and different nerve system in our body the vibrating one instrument is vibrating one nerve system the science also says the vibrating what is the how they work to vibrate to this in this body recent so many researches meeting and also so many people made phd also in this same music therapy anyway in my childhood i am thinking about uh, why not we will use for human being because so many chronic illness they are taking so much medicine and also they get reaction especially different sound is a different uh, correspondent uh, nerves the uh, different nerves actually if uh, there 72000 nerves in our body actually if you get uh, for one illness or anything to chronic disease especially that nerve will dead and recent doctors also they doing for they giving for medicine with dead nerve are you ready up 
that is only medicine also works so the sound also react this different 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 nerves such a nowadays was a very dangerous disease is coming so people suffering sleeplessness and also depression because people using for a computer and driving they get different pains in the body especially by back pain i don't mention that the big big diseases <clears throat> i don't want to tell a fraud about you so this all kind of the all the diseases to works to the sound system the sound sound therapy this also ancient technique chinese using this kind of a technique in the ancient times there was a bombo sounds there was a drum sounds different and bird sounds there slowly 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 they will develop and then computers came very easy to computer the sounds we see we are recording the all the different sounds to sampling to in uh, some instruments so good result so this is like a synthesizer uh, this actually synthesizer the sounds produce the different uh, medies different sounds so that's why i'm using for indian music especially karnataka music that karnataka music we have so many millions millions in different tunes ragas then we will take for one raga uh, tunes to assemble different sounds and then we are giving to crops or flowers or human being also it will work and slowly the people feels and immediately feel immediately the heal that's only like a illusion that is not correct i am not agree that is only some people gets only how who spis spis so psychologically they get good happy this, this is not good it is it wants a permanent to heal so especially i am developing some ragas we have a rotten big book also i think if you go ahead you can see that book then you understand how to heal with raga to people then you understand that very nice if you have a time there is a big volume this much volume maybe 2 kg i think 2 3 kg so big book volume and there is on two students also already get a phd for the research i have given all secrets in their book but very difficult to understand so in a way today i am very happy atlanta and the what is the atlanta my friends are arranging this kind of music hall so i am also very happy we will see how to you can go ahead relax take relaxation and sleep no problem if you sleep it will work this my music is that i am recommending all the times so if you go sleep and then low volume you can put so low volume in the tape recorder or any another machines you sleep that the vibrations will works to in your body so heals to in the inner systems are you can wake up no problem but that is how they work i am giving you details about this music now if you want to can sleep no problem if you want to wake up how to work but no calculation because i am calling the karnataka music but if you know calculate you are maybe you are utter fail so no calculation don't do any calculation 
you can only learn to how to listen that's only okay jai guru that i will start no more talking too much is not good okay
now we are going to meditation relaxation ragas like healing ragas there is a three ragas here one is a kasyapi second one yogini i think you are seeing for slides and last one maya maud gaula this kasyapi raga is a very wonderful very very powerful raga i experimented this raga in so many my my friends my relatives my family members my devotees there is a good result in this raga i think this is the first one today we are recording this raga uh, we have a recorded for 365 ragas so there was a big bunch uh, so many people is downloading it reasoning reasoning that very nice raga and uh, i experiment in myself this raga there is a big story so later on you know what is the story i i don't want to tell this because i have no time to tell so i want to to play
Last one, <coughs> this is very important uh, with all, all bodies works to all, all nervous systems also works to this raga, this tune, this is the final raga, it's maybe sometimes we get a very harsh and very smooth, very soothing, doesn't matter, you can sleep, as much as possible you can close our eyes, your eyes and sleep.
Wasn't that spectacular? <laughs> through his music, through his music, Pooja Sri Swamiji is stretching our imaginations. He's literally creating new worlds for us to explore. Truly amazing. Let's have another big rousing round of applause for Pooja Sri Swamiji, the celestial messengers, in this wonderful evening of Nada. I'd like to request the ladies and girls of DYC Atlanta to offer a Gajamala to Pooja Sri Swamiji. Happy to. Now I request Vasavi and Srikant Mantri to, pre to offer another garland to Puja Sri Swamiji. And now Lalita and Ishwar Bora will offer a garland to Pooja Sri Swamiji. Yet another. <laughs> this is a silk garland. We'd also like to honor the, the musicians this evening. So Mira and Yash, please come and offer an honorarium to Jaitra Varanasi, the violinist. Krupa and Bhavan Ravel will now offer or honor Mani Narasimha on the keyboard. Sajal and Dinesh Thanki 
please come and felicitate Shankara Ramesh on Radungam. Rajeshri Amanish Thakur will come now and felicitate Mahesh Bhatt on the tabla. <laughs> Finally, Niral and Devanch will honor Sri Jayadatta on the symbols. Before leaving tonight, I want to just take a moment and give a vote of thanks to the many people that made this program possible. First of all, we'd like to recognize the IEC management and especially Howard. Then we want to thank Prashant Kolipara, who played a large role in arranging the audio and video, and he represents the company Bytecraft. We're also very grateful to Satish Kodaboyna, who uh, provided all the prasadam this evening. And of course, we wish to thank all the volunteers and those who came from DYC Atlanta who made this program possible. Last but not least, we want to thank all of you, each and every one of you for coming out this evening. I know some of you came from very great distances, all of you made for such a memorable occasion. Thank you so much. <laughs> Finally, um, Prasad, Prasada boxes have been prepared for each of you. Please take them as you leave the auditorium. Um, we request that you don't eat them in the hall because it's not permitted. Um, and we also want you to be safe. So if possible, take the trolley to get to your car because that's the safest way to get into the parking lots. Um, and one final last thing, I want to wish you all a very peaceful and pleasant rest of your weekend. Thank you so much.